Well, I'm Kenny Lowry, and today we're going to take a look at what we're going to call the copper tone fountain. Now, this has kind of a copper effect to it. This is a cast stone uh, piece, but it is some copper pieces right in here, but it has kind of a coppery look, and I'll show you up close on the video and you'll see that. I really like this fountain. It's a contemporary style fountain. The unique thing about it is the way the water comes. You can kind of see under there, see the way the water kind of follows down there and then kind of kind of comes together as a unique way and then drops down. And it does that on both uh, right in this section and this section. And then it flows down. It's got a nice sound to it, kind of a trickling sound to it, we'll call it. Uh, probably the most unique thing about this is if you're at night, this actually comes with a light kit. So each one of these uh, gets illuminated back inside of there, and that is a really neat effect. So you have a light there, a light there, and then the light in the very top of that, uh, of the very top up there, so it illuminates that plume of water up there. And you do that with the uplighting, and, the, and because of the colors on this, I think it's going to really show up great at night. Right now, I'll grab the camera and show you. Uh, it is a very contemporary style fountain, and it also is available with its own basin. Uh, for decks and patios. We have it set up on top of a disappearing fountain system, which is our preferred fountain system because it is such low maintenance. But this, as you can see, we have it on a basin, and then the water comes up, and it comes out actually at three different places there. That first gap there where the copper piping is, there's water comes out there, the middle section, and then the very top as well. So you're adding water volume as you go on that fountain. Now I'll get around here and show you up close and you can kind of see that sheen of that kind of coppery color on there. I think it's a beautiful color. And I think you can pick up the sound. I really like the way that copper uh, accents there with the piping there in the middle too in those middle sections on each corner. Now we just have it set up here temporarily and I'm going to show you and talk a little bit about that. You can see those three hoses we've got coming out down there. There is three different sections where the water comes in on this mountain. So that's the reason we have the three hoses. You control the flow to each one of the hoses so that you can adjust the flow to however you want it to be to come out on your fountain. Now you see an access panel right there where the pump would go. You'd be using that if you were putting it on the patio deck bowl and you'll be able to see that elsewhere on the website set up as a patio and deck fountain. But this is a disc spring fountain. Now you see we have it set up on a couple of cinder block. Remember this is just set up temporarily. The hoses and everything, if you were setting it on your 4x4 basin, or 3x3 basin, I should say, uh, you would not see those hoses. The hoses would actually go down through the basin and then over in the corner, but we're just setting it up here temporarily. Also, you would not need the cinder blocks if you're doing it on your basin. You can do the cinder blocks if you're trying to make it taller. Uh, the only reason we have it set up there is because it's a temporary setup. We're going to take it apart and then set it up on a patio and deck its, its own basin and show you what that looks like. So this is just set up just to shoot this video. So you see it's really nice all the way around. Uh, you would not see any of this. This is where the pump access panel is. Remember that's all going to be down in the basin so you won't see any of that. It's a great looking fountain. As always, if you have any questions you can reach me at 540-948-2239 or email me Kenny at southerngraceva.com.